This is what we came here for today. I'm going to open a War of the Spark blue theme booster pack and hopefully get this uh, lovely lady in the pack. That's Kasmina. I'd like to have the Planeswalker to help complete a blue build that I'm working on. So let's get right into it. All right, so let's get this pack open. I don't want to rip it too hard. Pick this up at Walmart. Wasn't too overly priced, so reasonable. So let's see what the first one I pull on the cover is. She's in there. Yes, she is. There is Casmina. Take it out of the foil so you can see a bit better. Uh, Casmina is a legendary planeswalker. Uh, spells your opponent cast. The target a creature or planeswalker you control costs two more to cast. Uh, her negative two. She's a, a health of five when she comes in a power of five. Uh, she doesn't have a plus. She has only got a negative two, so you can only use her limited. But just to have her on the board for that spell buff is the reason that you have her. Uh, her negative two is create a 2-2 two -two blue wizard creature token, draw a card, and then discard a card. So that's not too bad at all if you're going to uh, have the blue wizard tokens on your table. So let's get into the pack to see what else we got. So Because maybe, just maybe, we got another planeswalker as well. But that's nice that they included her in the Planeswalker deck. I had a friend at work the other day open it and got the same thing. So maybe it's like a general thing that everyone's going to have Casmina and everybody's going to be playing Casmina. Uh, but that's uh, that's cool if it is. That's cool. Understandable so. But uh, maybe it's more rare than I think. But she's on the front of the cover so maybe that's the thing. There we go. And I can stop ad-libbing now because I actually got it open. So we got Casmina, uh, Casmina's Transmutation. Uh, we got Dovin as well, Dovin's new card from this uh, from this edition. Let's get Casmina into the camera as well before we go on. Got Casmina. Uh, there's Dovin as well. Uh, Dovin Hand of Control is an artifact, instant, and sorcery spell that costs opponents to cast uh, cost one more. Uh, and Sorcerer spells your opponent cast cost one more to cast. So again, that's a buff up. It makes it harder for them to cast their sorcery spells. And his negative one is until your next turn prevent all damage that would be dealt to and dealt by target permanent and non and opponent controls. So that's very cool. Let's see what else we got. Hopefully I get a gross spiral. The person I was with the other day got a gross spiral as well. I'd love to have a gross spiral for my proliferation deck. This uh, this This one right here. Jace, the Jace deck that came out with the new expansion. Uh, it's very effective. Uh, got Bond of Sight, Naga Eternal, Avon Eternal, Relentless Advance. The, the Amass. The Amass is like the new thing for this one. Um, Ashiok Skulker, Lazo Top Plating, Flux Channeler, No Escape. I've got a ton of those in my deck. Ton of no escapes. I'll probably put another one because that's I really like that card. That's counter target. Bring it up closer to the camera. No escape. It's counter target creature or planeswalker spell. If that spell is countered this way, exile it instead of putting it in the owner's grave. And then I get to scry one on top of that. So these look like pretty common cards other than the two. Got another Jason's Triumph. Let's draw two cards. If you have Jace on the table, you get three. That made me not, might be nice to put in my deck to have an extra one, but I think I already have two in that Jace deck. Um, I've got a common uh, neutral land and no color land emergency zone in the pack. Uh, that's turned to add one mana of any color. Uh, and then if you... Buff it with one and turn it. You sacrifice the emergency zone. You may cast spells this turn as though they had flash. That's not too bad. So unfortunately it does not look like I'm going to get the time. Oh, I've got a something legendary coming up. Let's see. I've got legendary creature, a homunculus. Flip it. <laughs> the lost. All right. Uh, legendary creature when Fabelthip, the lost, enters the battlefield, draw a card. If it is entered, if it entered, you're from your library or was cast from your library, draw two cards instead. When Philippit <laughs> becomes the target of a spell, shuffle Philippit into its owner's hand 
and I did not get a token, unfortunately. I got a card that tells you how to play the game. What it should look like. Lands on the bottom, creatures on the top, library and graveyard on your right. So, if anyone's wondering, that's how you do it. Alright, uh, so that's it. That is the War of the Spark Blue themed booster pack. So it's not uh, the great as I thought it was, but I got the two Planeswalker I was hoping to get. I got Casmina. She's definitely going to go into that blue deck that I want because uh, that's a really nice buff. Let's go back to her. A spells cost two more for the other people. So if you're playing a really spell-based deck, like a wizard deck or something like that, uh, that's really awesome. Uh, and then I also, if I negative two, I get a blue wizard creature, a 2-2 blue wizard creature. Then I can buff it up with other spells. So before we go, I'm going to open one pack of Alaxan, uh, just Alaxan green. Just a common pack. We'll see what else is in there. I picked this up. I've been focusing. Uh, I had a lot of Ravnica. Got a lot of Ravnica. I've been picking up a lot of commons from dollar stores. Uh, dollar store uh, packs. Where 100 in the bag for $4. Just to build my card collection. To see. To have a lot of commons. So now I'm starting to go back to the other expansions. Because uh, I got some Spark as well. I got this uh, big boy right here. The War of the Spark um, big pack. 36 booster pack I think is in there. We're going to open that soon. That's coming soon. Can't wait for that. But right now we're going to get this Alaxian in. We're going to see what's going on with that. Alright. So we got Shunning Aerosaur. A Fath Fathom Fleet Cutthroat. That's a pirate. A Ravenous Dagger Tooth. Uh... Sharper Apprentice, Kinjali's Collar, Stormfleet Pyromancer, Spreading Rot. That's a nice spell, but that's a high mana cost of four. But you destroy target land, its controller loses two life. <laughs> that's such a swamp card. That's such a black card. Uh, Raptor, Companion, Cobble the Wings, Spell Pierce, Counter Target Non Creature Spell, unless its controller plays two. And it's a spell cost of one. That's good for my blue deck. That is very good for my blue deck. Favorable, favorable winds. Creature you control with flying. Get a 1-1 one, one buff. So I've got a if I've got a bird deck or a dragon deck, that would be pretty good. Lurching, lurking Kupachabra. Is that similar to the other Kupachabra? When a creature you control explores, target creature an opponent controls gets two, negative 2-2 two, two till end of turn. Not really. And then I get a forest. And then the, my token is a treasure. My token's a treasure. So that's it. Thanks for joining me while we unpack that. It was just a quick video today. I'm trying to keep it under 10 minutes. But that's it. Uh, if you like the War of the Spark expansion, if you're trying to build a blue theme booster, uh, if you're trying to build a blue deck, that's a really good booster. Get, got Ka I got Kazmina and I got Dovin in the same pack. Uh, there's other Planeswalkers that are blue that you could probably pull out of there. I was hoping to get a different Jace because the Jace that came with War of the Spark, the regular one that came in the pre-built, isn't the greatest. So I'm looking for another Jace for my Jace deck. This is for another blue deck that I'm working on. But yeah, that's it. Uh, join me for more Magic the Gathering unboxings and just unboxings in general. And if you like what you see, please like the video and comment below. And while you're here, I'd greatly appreciate it if you subscribe to my channel. It helped me out a great amount. And like I said, this is coming up in a couple days. Dun dun dun. Magic the Gathering big box. That's it for today. I'm at dawn. And while you're at it, get over to my sister channel, the main channel, at dawn. This is at dawn's unboxing for you. And I'll talk to you soon. Mm -hmm.